Hey, what's going on, Fit Fam? This is Ed Harris with another edition of Fit and Focus. Gonna do a quick shoe demo for you. Now, it's been a debate for years. How many miles can you put on your shoe? The number one thing I tell you about this is it's gonna come down to how you feel in that shoe. Number two, you gotta give it what I call the eye test. So let's give this shoe an eye test. I'm gonna do this with you. Is this shoe good for running? Take a look at that. Look at that. I don't know if you can see. You know, if you were raised, I'm 46, so when we were growing up, shoes were good until they got a hole in the bottom, right? And so sometimes as, you know, everyday athletes, as we're transitioning from where we were to now, we kind of have that mentality. This shoe don't have any holes in it yet, and we really can't think of it that way. What we're talking about is the shoe really being like the tires on your car and preventative maintenance to keep you healthy, keep you from getting injured. So if you're like me and you like to wear that shoe until it's completely worn out, try to wear it a little bit less. Also, keep the shoe that you're gonna be walking and running and doing the primary work walk and workouts with, keep that shoe segmented almost to your workout. So if you are lifting weights and in the gym, but then you go outside and you run, I know it's kind of a pain, but if you have a running shoe and you can afford it, put that running shoe on to go run. Don't work out inside. It's actually almost a different exercise element when you're in a gym. So what you want to do is really try to start putting whatever you use to good use. So if you're out there in the trail, you can almost start measuring how many miles I have on the shoe. One of the things I do, and this hasn't worked very well, and we'll hear from you, you can put your comments in below how you track your miles, is I would write inside the shoe, you know, the date I bought it right? And then Fitbit has a tracking system. So as long as you can kind of monitor that, you can say, I bought this shoe on this date. And from here to there, I did approximately X amount of miles. And that's how you can kind of guesstimate. I got about 500 miles on this shoe. Uh, look at, give it the eye test. Looking pretty good. I'm going to maybe order this shoe again, or maybe I'll try some different ones. These are just all preventative things to hopefully keep you healthy and out there, keep you energized as you are on this fit journey. Everyday athletes like you and I getting it done. Hey guys, if you want more videos like this, let me know by leaving some comments in the comments below. Please subscribe and we look forward to talking to you again right here. Fit and focus, fit and focus.